Mass Readings for Sunday, July 21, 2024 16th Sunday in Ordinary Time Lectionary, 107 First Reading, Jeremiah 23, verses 1-6 to Woe to the pastors, that destroy and tear the sheep of my pasture, saith the Lord. Therefore thus saith the Lord the God of Israel to the pastors that feed my people, You have scattered my flock, and driven them away, and have not visited them. Behold I will visit upon you for the evil of your doings, saith the Lord. And I will gather together the remnant of my flock, out of all the lands into which I have cast them out, and I will make them return to their own fields, and they shall increase and be multiplied. And I will set up pastors over them, and they shall feed them, they shall fear no more, and they shall not be dismayed, and none shall be wanting of their number, saith the Lord. Behold the days come, saith the Lord, and I will raise up to David a just branch, and a king shall reign, and shall be wise, and shall execute judgment and justice in the earth. In those days shall Judah be saved, and Israel shall dwell confidently, and this is the name that they shall call him, the Lord our just one. The Word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Responsorial Psalm. Response, The Lord is my shepherd, there is nothing I shall want. A Psalm for David. The Lord ruleth me, and I shall want nothing. He hath set me in a place of pasture. He hath brought me up, on the water of refreshment. He hath converted my soul. Response, The Lord is my shepherd, there is nothing I shall want. He hath led me on the paths of justice, for his own name's sake. For though I should walk in the midst of the shadow of death, I will fear no evils, for thou art with me. Thy rod and thy staff, they have comforted me. Response, The Lord is my shepherd, there is nothing I shall want. Thou hast prepared a table before me against them that afflict me. Thou hast anointed my head with oil, and my chalice which inebrieteth me, how goodly is it! Response, The Lord is my shepherd, there is nothing I shall want. And thy mercy will follow me all the days of my life and that I may dwell in the house of the Lord unto length of days. Response, The Lord is my shepherd, there is nothing I shall want. Second reading, Ephesians 2, verses 13-18 But now in Christ Jesus, you, who sometime were afar off, are made nigh by the blood of Christ. For he is our peace, who hath made both one, and breaking down the middle wall of partition, the enmities in his flesh. Making void the law of commandments contained in decrees, that he might make the two in himself into one new man, making peace. And might reconcile both to God in one body by the cross, killing the enmities in himself. And coming, he preached peace to you that were afar off, and peace to them that were nigh for by him we have access both in one Spirit to the Father. The Word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Alleluia. Alleluia, Alleluia. My sheep hear my voice, and I know them, and they follow me. Alleluia, Alleluia. Gospel, Mark 6, verses 30-34. And the apostles coming together unto Jesus, related to him all things that they had done and taught. And he said to them, Come apart into a desert place, and rest a little. For there were many coming and going, and they had not so much as time to eat. And going up into a ship, they went into a desert place apart. And they saw them going away, and many knew and they ran flocking thither on foot from all the cities, and were there before them. And Jesus going out saw a great multitude, and he had compassion on them, because they were as sheep not having a shepherd, and he began to teach them many things. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ.